Hi everyone, it's Shannon and welcome to my channel, The Daily DIYer. I have some $1 organization hacks to share with you today using all items from Dollar Tree and probably some unique items you never thought to use before to help organize your outdoor spaces in very practical and simple ways. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna head outside. I'm gonna show you my back porch. This is a space that is kind of multifunctional. Obviously it's kind of used used as a potting station for me. It has some of my herbs and gardening supplies, but it also unfortunately is a catch-all for some of our outdoor items too. You can see toys and shoes and some cleaning supplies and even some decorative items that aren't being used very well. So this very first idea I want to share with you is to utilize these larger planters that I picked up from Dollar Tree. I have lots of ideas and hacks that I've used these for and I'll link that video down in the description box if you want more ideas for this but I had some extras and I'm gonna be using those on this potting station first so of course everything got a deep cleaning first and then I'm using these planters as organizers on this console table. So this used to be in our house and I just sealed it really well and put it on, on our back patio and using it as a potting station and organization space too for some of our outdoor items. So you can see in these planters, I have some potting soil, some of my decorative things and things for my flowers, some extra terracotta pots and planters and even for those shoes that were out there. I am so hoping that Dollar Tree continues to carry these large planters year after year as I have utilized them in so many different ways around our home and this is just another one of those ideas. And since I had a couple extra ones, I also thought I'd throw in this idea too. I have a drill with a large drill bit and at the bottom of these planters there's little circles and I'm just drilling right down into those circles where it's a little bit more thin on these pots to give it some drainage holes. But we're not gonna be using this as a flower planter. We're gonna be using this to organize and store some outside toys. So my son has basketballs and soccer balls and baseballs. And so I thought this would be a great way to keep them all together and take some space out of our cabinet. So that way he has access to them. If it rains on them, it's fine because of those drainage holes, super easy and kind of kept everything together from rolling around. Next up is a idea using these hooks over the door hooks from Dollar Tree. These are my favorite ones. They are black, they're a little bit more decorative and they have the four hooks on them and they're also powder coated so they'll be okay to use outside. I'm actually just adding one to the outside of our back patio cabinet. So instead of using it inside, you can utilize these outside too. You can hang something like beach towels on them, things that maybe get wet that you need to hang up to dry. So super quick, simple, and of course, only $1. This is my favorite hook system from Dollar Tree. You actually screw these into the wall, but they have several hooks on the front. So you get a lot of storage space out of these. I thought I would install this onto the front bottom of my decorative window on our patio. But as you can see, when I added my gardening tools, it just was too low and they were kind of hanging down and into my workspace, which is kind of what I was trying to get away from. So I had a clean potting station surface on that console table. So I decided to um, arrange these hooks a little bit differently so that they would hang higher up. So I got some heavy duty pliers. I did some bending of these hooks, which took some muscle. These are pretty heavy duty. I mean, the wire and metal that they use to make these is really good quality, but it's just covered with a white kind of plastic coating. So all I did was bend these hooks up and then I'll be installing this on the underside of a shelf. That shelf is another Dollar Tree um, organization hack, which I will link that video down below too if you wanna go back and watch that. Um, and I'm just installing this with some screws up underneath that shelf so that I can then hang things like my gardening gloves and my gardening tools. Do you enjoy gardening? Let me know down in the comments below. I'm actually pretty terrible at it myself, 
But you can see I have a succulent garden up there on that shelf and I couldn't be more proud that it is thriving and I've kept it alive. It's actually in an old toolbox and I will link that video down below if you missed that. But I couldn't be more happy that my beautiful succulents are still alive. So you can see just with that simple little adjustment, I now have storage space up off of my work surface. So that is nice and clean, but yet I still have those items readily available and handy when I need them. And another idea to install onto these hooks are these plastic buckets. These are some of my favorite organization items from Dollar Tree. They are plastic buckets with handles and they come in a set of three for a dollar. So only about 33 cents each such a great bargain and you can hang those handles right onto those hooks so you can either put things that you need to store into those buckets or you can even plant some flowers or herbs in there too These drinking containers are also new to Dollar Tree for the summer season, and I thought they would be so perfect to store bubbles in. So if your kids are anything like mine, a lot of bubbles get spilled during the summertime. This kind of will help keep that from happening. The bubble solution is from Dollar Tree too, and I'm just using a funnel to put the solution right into that container. The lids have a little stopper on them, so you can close it and open it as you need it. It also has that really handy handle off to the side, which is great for kiddos and for parents that are needing to refill those bubble containers. This is another great item Dollar Tree carries. They are plastic or rubber buckets that have nice handles on the side and it makes for a perfect bubble station. So what I'm gonna do is just add my new bubble container, some extra bubbles into that bucket, even one of those small containers in there to kind of help keep things organized. And you can add bubble toys in there, bubble wands, and then you can carry it wherever you need to. And it's great because it's rubber and it's plastic, so you can just hose it all off uh, when you're done and let it dry and use it over and over again. Now I showed you some unique items in the intro of this video that you're probably like, what is she going to use those for? And first I wanna show you this drawstring bag. It actually has a mesh front and then a plastic back. So these are so good during the summertime when you're using things that are wet like water guns. So we have lots of these. My son loves to use these. And this is a great way to kind of keep them all together, but obviously they get wet. So this is a great way to also store them, but let air go through so you can let it dry as well. You just stuff them all in there. This also works great for pool items or beach items. So you can carry them along with you to and from. And this is another great way for you to utilize these outdoor hooks and you can hang them off there to let everything dry. Now this is sort of fun. I want to show you how you can utilize these dog collars from Dollar Tree in a unique way and that is to keep things from coming unraveled and also keep, keep things together so they stay organized. So I'm just wrapping this dog collar around an extension cord a couple times and as you can see now you won't have a tangled mess the next time you need to pull out an extension cord for outside or even inside use. You can also just just wrap it around one time and leave it longer and then you can hang it from a railing or inside of your garage and even the dog collars have little metal hooks on the front so you can hang it from a nail too. Dollar Tree also has these great laundry bags that are pretty good size, so they hold quite a bit. You don't wanna put anything too heavy in them, but they are perfect for outdoor toys, especially if you are going to be taking them to the park or for a picnic.
I have even more $1 and budget friendly organization idea videos popping up on your screen that you can check out next. I also want to thank you all so much for joining me. I would love to have you subscribe if you are new and I will see you in the next video. Bye everyone.